apologize for the USA pageant for 2023. As one of the most famous decorated influences of our time, that being Michelle Phan, <laughs> at the end of all her videos, she always said, good luck. Good luck, everyone. And with that lucky spirit, I'm taking that with me to Miss USA. Thank you very much. Hey guys, it's Patty Strong. Welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a fun freaking vlog for the week. I am going to be a judge at Miss USA 2023. We just landed right here in Reno, Nevada, where everything is happening. It's literally like a mini Las Vegas casino resort here in Reno, and we're so excited. We just got into the room, and today, guys, I am filming on a camcorder. I thought it would change up the vibes. So it'll just be a little bit different, but a little bit the same, because I'm in it, you're here, and that's all that matters. So without further ado, let's just get right into this vlog. If you guys want to see more vlogs like this, comment down below, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and don't forget that makeup is a one size fits all. This is what the hotel is giving, guys. This is what the hotel is giving. This is what the desert is giving right here. We have Peter in today's vlog. We have Fabian in today's vlog. We have the room, it's a huge room. And then we have Ronnie. Hey guys. Ronnie's gonna be doing my makeup this week. And he just came from Miss Continental, which is- It is the uh, LGBT version of the Miss USA, Miss, Miss Universe, Miss USA. Miss USA. It's literally uh, drag queens and the most amazing glamazons to walk this earth competing in that pageant. So I was like, hey sister, why don't you just come with me to this pageant called Miss USA. So he came and he's here and we're gonna have fun. But look how close the airport is, you guys. It's literally, that's the airport right there. And we just drove around and came right to this hotel. Also, by the way, let me know if you guys like this camcorder style type of vlog. The zoom is like fantastic. Peter's talking to mom. Guys, this is the glam station. It's going to be this whole week of glamour. You know what? We just take a hot shower and put the dress right next to it. <laughs> I just got a call from PSI, the organization that issues the state board exam, and they called my work phone and Peter answered, and they were like, we just want to say thank you for, we saw that your test, you took the test and PSI, and regarding the rules, thank you for following them. And I was like, okay, and that we need to better communicate like the rules. And I was like, no, it was communicated. Like I heard it loud and clear, like in my face. So I thought they were gonna re revoke my license or something. Wow. I'm like obsessed with the camcorder and the makeup. Me. Give me water. Looks like you're douching, girl. <laughs> girl. Guys, look at the dilemma. They couldn't eat here where we're eating, so they're gonna go find a restaurant. Vegans. All right, guys, so we just went downstairs in the hotel, and we just realized there's nothing here in Reno. Like, the buffet's closed, the restaurant's closed, but we just decided to come here to this cafe. It's called the Grand Cafe. There's plenty of vegan options here. How it looks good, guys. They're so excited to eat here. Oh my gosh, you guys, we just had the longest, like, most chill lunch, and we're here in the casino. They are going to get coffee here at Starbucks, but what's so cool is that I'm meeting, like, the glam team that are saying hi, because a lot of the makeup artists and hairstylists backstage are saying hi, so from all my makeup artists and hairstylists out there, hello! So fun meeting you guys, and I'm happy that Ronnie glammed me a little bit so I don't look all types of crazy, but as they do a coffee stop, we're gonna go ahead and do a dessert pit stop, because Ronnie wants dessert! So yummy, so gorgeous, so I'm tempted a little bit to have a little bit of a something, something. Look at that, that looks so yummy. I don't know. All right guys, we are here at the Grand Theater, where it's the main entrance of where Miss USA and Miss Teen USA is gonna be, because I didn't know that Miss Teen USA is going on at the same time. If you're watching this, girls from Miss Teen USA, I love you guys so much. Best of luck to all of you. And to all the Miss USA girls, you got it. This is my skincare routine as a judge for Miss USA. If you guys didn't know, I am here in Reno, Nevada, where the pageant Miss USA and Miss Teen USA is taking place. 
really want my skincare to look good for the pageant, so I am literally trying my best to look good for the girls because we got beauty queens up in here, okay? Okay. Mm-hmm. When I tell you my skin is about to be popping this Friday at Miss USA, y'all ain't ready. And that's my skincare routine. So last night was a very uh, a long day of travel and also I just did my skincare and my skin is like looking and feeling good. And today is day one officially of Miss USA. So we have Ronnie right here, buenos dias. Yeah. Peter's here. And uh, Ronnie said that he went down for coffee and you saw all the girls in rollers, right? They're in their rollers, they're in their little sashes and their uh, interview outfits and their glam is like fully done and then they could not speak to their family members because they were trying to speak to like their family and the security guard was like, we went over this, you can't speak to your family, let's go ladies. Get on the elevator, go to your room. So, Rodney's gonna help me do glam today. You know, if you guys wanna see the TikToks and things, follow me on there. But also, if you guys are not following me, the craziest thing is that I am throwing up a Miss USA discount code. By the time this vlog goes up, it's gonna be over. But if you're not following me on Instagram or TikTok, you're gonna miss these like special discount moments for onesizebeauty.com. So, be sure to follow me on there. I'm gonna jump into glam and I'm excited for day one and I'm also a little bit nervous. So, let's get glam. Be really rearranging furniture. Here. Girl, she swears she's competing. Girl, she's just a judge. Shut up. <laughs> Guys, I don't know if you guys can see with the lighting, but this is my finished outfit. So I have some heels. I have all good American. Good American pants, good American corset. I have this beautiful trench coat. Good American. I have this YSL bag. The face is beat. Yeah, and we are about to head down to go interview the girls. And I think we also have like a little judge training. So I'm so excited. Let me show you guys the makeup. This is the beautiful makeup that Ronnie did on me. Super full glam, but I mean anything for Miss USA. So I'm obsessed. We went for like a little smoky wing. This 90s lip, no highlighter. Literally so, so glam. The eagle is about to land. The eagle is about to land. Eagle? Big Bird is a to land. <laughs> Big Bird is about to land. Guys, we are here. This is gonna be the room where we interview all the girls. Unfortunately, we cannot reveal the questions and the contestants, but this is a little behind the scenes tour. So right here we have the crafty. And over here, this is where we'll be sitting and doing the interviews. They get five minutes each, and I'm excited, I'm nervous. But we'll get through it. These are the rainy. Miss USA and Miss Teen USA will be locked in here, interviewing all day, so we can pick a Miss USA 2023. You guys, this is so hard. We are now up to Iowa next. So we have the rest of what seems like 50 more states to go. Everyone is stunning, gorgeous, hair done, makeup done, outfit, jewels. And right now, I'll show you guys, we have like a little Bible of everyone's bio, everything um, of each of the girls, their ambitions, their missions, their interests, their hobbies, and also too, for social media, what platform they like. Some of them, their favorite app is DoorDash. <laughs> <laughs> One of them wanted to like um, start a beauty company. They're like looking at me. And then they're like, I watch YouTube videos. Someone is a social media influencer, full time. Uh, and you go, and I'm body like, oh. points won't work here. <laughs> but it will work with me. Dead. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Oh my gosh, you guys. The interviews. Amazing. And we have to do a quick change. We just grabbed some sushi really quick. And guys, we, we were judging. How long was I in there judging for? Uh, judging for five, five hours. Oh my, like six and a half hours we were judging. All 51. We interviewed. They got five minutes each. And we took maybe two or three breaks, 10 minute breaks, five to 10 minute breaks. It was back to back, it was very quick, it was very personable and we loved it. And now we're gonna judge the costume competition and I gotta change to my dress that I just got made. And so let's go. Look at his forehead. <laughs> Cinderella, Cinderella. Guys, we did it. We are on the way down. The corset is really tight, I don't know why. I decided to eat right before putting on this dress because baby, this thing is snatched. I cannot breathe. Look at how small my waist is from the front. But then I to the side, it's getting a sushi roll. And the earrings are so pretty because, because they're kind of like moonstone color. And I picked this kind of like green reflective fabric in downtown. And shout out to my friend Perry Meek for creating this gown last minute. <laughs> Guys, we are officially backstage here at Miss USA 2023 here in Reno. Guys, we 
just finished the costume contest and Miss Hawaii won on the Misses category. I'm so honored to be here, so shout out to everyone here at Miss USA. I'm really, really, really thankful and I can't believe that YouTube and this as a job has taken me to everything that you guys have seen and to a show that I have grown up watching, which is Miss USA. So thank you guys so much. All right, guys, I put my camcorder on the little tripod. I'm not gonna say my scores or my thoughts, but I would love to hear from the distinguished panel of civilian judges. Love that chicken for Popeye. All right, so what I was thinking <laughs> is New Jersey brought it. New Jersey brought it. I'm a Jersey boy, so New Jersey brought it. I didn't see California because I was at the bar. Louisiana with the fried chicken and that the rice and chicken. Miss teen. No, was teen. she was. Was that she was? Teen. That was teen. 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 They were fierce. Yeah. They were really fierce. They were fierce. Do you guys have a winner or a top five? It's hard. I, mean, I, I, I have, have to write it down. I don't I, remember I, anything. I would like to go ahead and hear their answers. <laughs> yes. To I go ahead and speak. have a rounded answer. Yes. Guys, someone almost followed us to our room. <laughs> and I'm a bodyguard over here. We're all in the elevator, and he's wearing a football jersey, right? Yes, and a hat. And a hat. Yeah, and then we were, like, we were like going out, and then he got off at the same time. But he hit a different floor, and then we almost went around. Like Ronnie was like, yo, 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 wait. Because wait. I don't play that And he went ahead. And he was like lingering. I think he would want to see where we were. So I was like, let me just take some content. So we did a little video, went back into the other, and then went to his real floor. I was trying to spot him. And did he say, you're beautiful? He did. Yeah, yeah, he did. Well, where is he at? Yeah. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> Ruined my chances with an athlete. Girl, bye. Okay. He was not an athlete. That, 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 that was that tacky outfit. <laughs> well, let me take out my makeup, and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning to me to you to this tan line um, i'm alone in my room and you can imagine that i rarely get time to like just talk to you guys and it's hard to process my thoughts like i i'm sure you saw like how hectic it was for me like yesterday being a judge i like peter's like vlog peter will, will throw the camera in my face and say just okay say something to the, to the vlog and i'm like okay and then the ceo of miss usa is like oh my god take a picture with miss usa like that's gonna pass her crown this year and i'm like okay Peter's like, say the vlog. And then Nicole Miller's like, let's take a picture. And then the other judge is like, oh, let's, let's do something. And I'm like, the reason why I wanted to do this right here, this clip right here, is just to have me and you, no one else, just really say thank you for everything. I, I genuinely mean it. Like, I'm pinching myself that I'm here at a show that I get to, that I've watched as a kid that was just a thing that I thought was only for a certain type of person or a certain group of people, no one like myself. So it just means a lot that I get to have these things. And, and I also continue to vlog, even if they don't have a lot of views. It's literally for me, for when I look back at my career, in this very moment in 2023, I can look back and be like, oh my gosh, I, I really did that. And I'm proud of everything that I've done. And I think a part of life and a part of like my journey is like having like gratitude and like being thankful and, being just open to new opportunities and i'm happy that i get to share this type of stuff with you but also like this is low-key for me because sometimes i doubt myself sometimes i don't i don't know i just question my things and coming into this prestigious like spot at the table as a judge for miss usa you know i'm like i'm just an influencer and then you know ronnie and fabian are like you have a brand you've worked with celebrity you're a licensed esthetician and i'm like okay okay i got it but you have to understand like patrick star is like a is someone that i created like to be glam to be secure oh someone's here now but just with that i'm vlogging say hi hey guys it is so <laughs> no, damn no. dry i need to give you a, a mini facial oh yes i need it because my skin is so it is a dry, honey. Nice this is my second pair of like patches. I put like the first ones on and the first ones went. Let me just give you a little facial in the bathroom. Let's go. Give Ronnie a little facial in the bathroom. Giving my dehydrated best friend a facial as a licensed esthetician. Take this off. First, pre-cleanse with an oil cleanser. Oil breaks down oil and you need to like soften, like get your forehead really nice and oily so it softens. The crust. By the way, this is my skincare. This is our second cleanse by Shannon Darden. This is the serum cleansing gel. Next, we're gonna take the Dermalogica Daily Microfoliant. This is a physical mechanical exfoliant. And you wanna put a little bit on the hand. 
just like that. Mix it into like a little paste, just a little bit of water, just a little bit of water. So if you're using actives like hyaluronic acid or moisturizer and you have all of this dead skin, there's no point in putting on top of dead skin if you're not scrubbing it. So do your best gently. Okay, so next we're gonna take the Tatcha Essence. This will allow whatever you use after this to penetrate deep into the skin. Okay guys, this is an active serum. This is by Shani Darden. It's a little tingly. So we're gonna layer this on now that we've decrusted. Hold on, Shannon Darden like from Charmed? No, not Shannon Darden, bitch. Now I like to add these hydrating products to kind of seal everything. So this one's gonna be the Fresh Rose Deep Hydrating Bouncing Emulsion, and then the Fresh Rose Deep Hydrating Serum. So I like Hella hydration. In case you do all these exfoliants and then your skin purges a little bit, now it has pathways for your oil sebum to come out. And that's our skincare tutorial for today. As a licensed esthetician, the kids will never know <laughs> what it took to get to my level in my career. This is how we recorded back in the late 1900s, honey. <laughs> the vlog girlies could never, <laughs> they could never. Guys, we are taking a little break. We are at this place called Pine State Biscuits. And then they what specialize in biscuits and biscuit sandwiches. And we got some biscuits. Ooh, Show them. Ooh, so good. beautiful. Ready? And then baked vegan sauce. And then I got chicken fried steak. And Ronnie got a coffee. Yummy! Ronnie, where are we? We are at the Grand Sierra, Sierra? Sierra Resort. Resort in Reno, Nebraska. Nevada. Whatever. <laughs> oh, why are you filming me? Peter ran to get this camera to just expose how I do my TikToks. Okay. This is a day in my life as a judge for Miss USA 2023. Y'all, this is day one and we landed here in Reno, Nevada. Stay tuned for day two to see prelims for Miss USA. We did the full glam. Are you surprised? Another like Playtex number. And it's hot, so Fabian has to help me put these little toilet papers in here because I just sweat. So much. But well, look at the earrings. The earrings are cute. The earrings are cute. I glued everything. And I'll see you guys in the audience. Beauty entrepreneur and founder of One Size Beauty, Patrick Starr. <laughs> How was today? Oh my god, I can't even think. That <laughs> tight. It was gorgeous. It was fabulous. The girls slayed. My tablet broke two times. They tried sabotaging me. They tried taking me down. But my scores are just as valid as everybody else's. Yeah. By the end of the vlog, I expect you, all of you, to tell me which outfit is your favorite and why can you guys give me a 1 through 10 on each outfit you can use that most to like a 5.5 or 9.9 .9. she better work 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 from new jersey ronnie come on patrick star hey vlog say hi guys and the prelims night too where are you from virginia virginia what are you doing at miss usa i'm hair and makeup for virginia virginia team <laughs> go virginia and you too we did hair and makeup hair and makeup and i did it for miss colorado team usa and our team has nevada and nebraska i like how cool that everyone has a glam team i was, everybody i had a good team oh my god no you guys are amazing and you? I did Miss South Carolina Tane and she got top 20 shows. Yeah. I'm from Alabama. I did Alabama Tane. Everyone is so talented. So lovely meeting you guys. I can't wait to see all the club. Good morning. I had a two hour meeting just now, right there, for one size. About 2024, and now I'm just face tuning. <laughs> And then we're gonna get ready for the red carpet today. Last night was so fun. Miss Teen USA ended yesterday, and congratulations to Miss Teen New Jersey for winning Miss Teen USA 2023. A lot of the teen girls that weren't able to say hi could now talk to a judge, and a lot of them are gonna be watching Miss USA tonight. And so, T, I've worn this dress a few times before, you guys. It's already on my channel. I wear it with Mistress. 
and I wore it in another video, I'm gonna go ahead and just wear it again today, just because I had no time to do all day, so. But, when I tell you the looks have been looking, the looks have been twirling, we, the queen has been queen, we're out here. Oh, and also my mom tagged me in a little clip from prelims last night. Patrick Star. Author <laughs> of One Size Beauty. You saw it? Patrick Star. <laughs> So cute. I'm gonna get ready and then I'm gonna be posting a TikTok and a separate YouTube video after this or before this of Ronnie doing my makeup. So if you guys wanna see how I get tonight's look, go ahead and check out that video. Guys, this is Fabian. You've known him. He is my confidant, my sister, my shoelace tire, my stylist, my seamstress, my turban maker, sometimes my makeup artist, my editor, <laughs> my producer. <laughs> I think it's gonna work. He said, I don't have a steamer for your dress. <laughs> but is it gonna work? I find solutions in what I do. No, we're gonna blow dry it later. Blow dry? <laughs> Guys, look at this room. Put some panties there. It's <laughs> a corset. Look how messy Patrick is. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is his wedding outfit from yesterday. Look at all this vegan food. That's not vegan. But if you guys didn't know, they have vegan cookies up in here. I go, is this your makeup one? No, my. Don't even hate. We're gonna do the glam. Ronnie's over here, all quiet, I know, right? Out of everyone, Ronnie's the quietest. So I'm gonna do my brows, <laughs> and then we're gonna go get glam. I think I'm gonna do my tutorial right here on this camcorder, okay, so stay tuned. Y'all, this is the biggest struggle of life, and it's always getting past the zipper, and you can see we added so much more tool on this. You guys will see when we're done. Guys, this dress does not f zip up, so. We're just gonna put a little blanket on the top. <laughs> Guys, everything that went wrong with the outfit, the zipper won't work. <laughs> Our attack gun broke, but who cares? I love you guys! Have so much fun! Well, we made it. We went flights of stairs down. I almost fell. We, we, we cut the dress a little bit on the way, but this is the finished look. We're about to go into Miss USA. All the girls are inside, and I'm excited. I'm soaking it in. Pins. You mean emergency pins? Because girl, Ronnie, help me. Oh my god. Was it? Ah. <laughs> Ooh, you guys, we have a taco meeting right now at Uno Mas. If you can get there. Y'all, I changed it just some flats and some sneakers. Put on the same outfit I have for interview day one, and we're just gonna celebrate the night. We're gonna get some tacos. There's an after party to see if we can get in. We're gonna have fun, and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Look at oh. me. Look at us. Look at us. Good morning. It is the next day. We are packing our messy room, and I forgot I, I had this for Ronnie this whole time, and I found it when I was unpacking. Here. Oh, my queen. Our Miss uh, USA. <laughs> don't anybody say anything. Thank you. Of course, of course. Guys, look at the room. 
The room is trashed. I don't know why Fabian put everything like this in here. <laughs> well, I did Fabian. not do this. Look at the Fabian. That's your clothes. Look at your shoes. That's you coming in like a mom. I want to take video of Fabian putting this dress <laughs> no, no, no. back in by himself. <laughs> no, the bodice. <sighs> I need a body bag right now. I did it! <laughs> Show the camera. You're out ready. This is disgusting! <laughs> this is Patrick's dog. Fabian. <laughs> <laughs> Why you do me like that? Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm here with Noelia. Oh my gosh, Miss Yoyce! You guys have to follow us on TikTok and Instagram to see how we did this look. But that is it for my Miss USA 2023 vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. Follow her everywhere listed on the screen. And thank you so much. What does it feel like to win Miss USA 2023? It feels incredible. I can't wait to represent the USA at Miss Universe in El Salvador in just a month. But it's opportunities like this and also being able to give back to my community that make it all worth it. So thank you so much, Patrick. Oh my gosh, thank you. I am literally fangirling. A dream come true. <laughs> Love you guys. Don't forget makeup, but some one size fits all. I hope to see you all in my next video. Bye. Bye.